What's up guys, welcome back, it's your boy Richie Rich. Uh, I'm doing a little review on the RCI1 Extreme motor mounts that I discovered on the internet. These are firewall mounts for motors <clears throat> with the 6mm bearing tube. They were $1.50 a piece, I paid 5 bucks for 4 of them, something like that. Um, as you can see on my RC1 Extreme, the motor mount itself is a lot different. You see that there? It's, it's really awesome. And for five dollars you cannot beat it so each one comes in this little package like this <clears throat> as you can see it says uh, firewall mount for motors with a six millimeter bearing tube you get 40 little packages obviously they are very very light they have the set screws on the sides which are awesome and they mount right to my Phoenix flight gear motor um, carbon fiber frame. I'm gonna take this one apart and I'll uh, get back to you in a minute because I gotta show you a little mod that I had to do. Real simple. But as you can see that's the old style. Very junky plastic and it always slips out of the motor. So I'll be back with a quick update. I'll see you in a minute. Alright guys. So I put one bolt on there. Now they almost line up perfect. I mean almost so close, so close. So if you get a 1 16th drill bit, as so, and drill through the top hole, the opposite angle, and just make the hole a tiny, tiny bit bigger. That's all you need to do. And you can put two screws in. You don't have to put all four. So I'm going to drill my hole. I'm going to put a piece of tape on this so it doesn't move, even though you might not need it, just for security reasons. And I'm going to get it where I want it, and then I'm going to drill my hole, I'm going to put the bolt in, and I'll be right back. Alright guys, so there you have it. I actually put three screws in. I didn't put one right here, but I probably will. Because these ones were real short, and I had this extra one, so I said oh, I'll put it in. But as you can see, it's on the arm. Almost perfect. You see right through the big hole there. Now, the best part. Alright, take those little set screws out. all the way in get yourself some trusty Loctite shake the shit up That one, don't tighten it all the way yet. You don't want to cross the ideas neither, they should just go in nice and easy. See there we go. Snug. One. Snug on the other. Get that Loctite off. And voila. Whoop, there it is. I'll just put it back on your eye one extreme as so. And you'll be good to go. Alright guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you found it useful.